What's going on guys, it's your boy Legitimate here, back with another video, and today, sorry for all the background noise, we are currently sitting under a gazebo right beside a road, so you're probably going to hear some background noise here and there, and some chainsaw noises, because we heard those earlier, so we had to move to a different gazebo, but basically today, we are with a special guest, Lizzie. Welcome back, this is my um, view getter, so every time I post a video with Lizzie, I get views, so <laughs> shout out to that, but today, we have 30 sneaker trivia questions, true or false, stuff like that for Lizzie. And today, we're just going to ask away. So if Lizzie gets 20 out of 30 correct, then she passes. Anything below that's a fail. Lizzie has a decent amount of sneaker knowledge because obviously she's my girlfriend, so I talk to her about sneakers literally all the time. But, hope you guys enjoyed this video. How many likes you want, Liz? 20. Let's get 20 likes on this video. Shout out to me and Lizzie. We're matching. Shout out to Baby Yoda. Champion. Baby Yoda will be featured in one of these questions. So. Oh, goodness. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoy. Let's get this video to 20 likes. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. I'm trying to hit 4,500 subscribers by the end of the summer and 5,000 subscribers by the end of the year. Apologize for the background noise, but we're going to jump right into the video. So we hope you enjoy. All right. A third of these are true and false questions. So let's just see what Lizzie's got. Probably her least favorite of anything true or false. So let's just get this out of the way first. First true or false question. Adidas owns Reebok. False. That is incorrect. Dang it! Adidas does own Reebok, and they're doing an upcoming collab with James Harden coming out soon. I'm starting off rough already. Oh, for one. Number two, there have been only 13 editions of Kevin Durant's shoe, so KD has only had up to 13 shoes. False. You are incorrect again. Oh my god! Oh, for two. Goodness gracious. <laughs> I'm doing Lizzie's so starting bad. off to a very bad start. All right, true or false? LeBron's shoes are either low, mid, or high top. So, I'm going to give this to just LeBron 17s. If you say it's true, that means there's a low, mid, and high top version of the LeBron 17. If you say it's false, then it's false. So, what do you think? False. That is correct. Her finally! First white finally! One, her first right one of the day. Oh my goodness. One for three. LeBron's shoes are only low tops and high tops in his LeBron 17 model. Question number four. There are three types of Air Force Ones. What do you mean by three types? So, there's a low, and then is there three types? Yes, or true oh, or false? Low, like low or high top? True or false. There's three types of Air Force One. False. That is incorrect. Oh my gosh! There are three types of Air Force Ones. Lows, mids, and highs. One for four. Starting off very terrible. Question number five. Joel Embiid signed with Nike. He's an NBA player for the Philadelphia 76ers. True. That is false. Oh my gosh! <laughs> One for five. Lizzie is destroying it right now. Joel Embiid signed with Under Armour. Question number six. There have been 35 Jordan numbered sneakers, so true or false? True. That is incorrect. Oh my god! <laughs> One for six. There are 34 Jordan sneakers. All right, you better get some answers correct. These are hard! No, they're not. Yes, they are! All right, number seven. Beyonce has collabed on a sneaker. I'm gonna get this one wrong. What was the last answer? False. True. Beyonce has collabed on a sneaker. Thank Two, god. four, seven. Two for five? Two for seven. So, <laughs> yeah, Beyonce collabed with Adidas this okay. year. All right, there's my Baby Yoda question. There's a Baby Yoda Adidas collab. True. No. That is incorrect. Dang it! <laughs> Two for eight. There's a Baby Yoda in my shirt, but this is definitely not Adidas. There is a I Yoda collab. Yet. That's a Yoda collab, not a Baby Yoda collab. Two for eight. Lizzie's off to a horrible start. If she gets four more wrong, she fails. So. All right, Marvel has collabed with Vans and Adidas. Question number nine. Marvel has collabed with Vans. And Adidas. True. That is correct. She is three for nine, I'm pretty sure. All right, number 10, 10th question. Starting off three for nine is not gonna help your score, but here's the true or false question. Michael Jordan almost signed with Adidas. Well, I know that he, like he has the Jordans, so I mean, I don't know. True or would, false? He was signed with Adidas. Michael Jordan almost signed with Adidas. True. Good job. So I think after his second season, his mom convinced him to stay with Jordan because he wanted to assign with Adidas. All right, question number 11. So you are 4 for 10 right now. Stephen Curry signed with Nike at first and then signed to Under Armour. True or false? These are hard. I'm sorry. It's okay. He signed right now with Under Armour, right? Yes, but Stephen Curry signed with Nike at first and then signed with Under Armour. True or false? False. He's with Under Armour the whole time. Correct. Nike tried to get Stephen Curry, but they pronounced his name Stephen Curry, so that really gave Stephen Curry a bad vibe. So good job, Lizzie. 5 for 11. Two more tr true or false left, okay? Donovan Mitchell, I have his jersey for the Jazz, has his own signature sneaker. True or false? True. Okay, true. All right, last question. Bradley Beal has his own signature sneaker. False. That is correct. 
Lizzie is 7 for 13 coming out of the true and false, and she is glad to be done with this category. Absolutely. <laughs> Alright, so now, these are basically questions or naming things. So, first question, how much do Jordan 4's retail for? So the Jordans are a little bit more expensive retail. There's three answers that are correct in um, different ways, so if you give me one of those answers. I mean, does it be like the exact number, or can it be like a range? Like if it's like... It's gotta be, exactly. I don't, what are the Jordan 4's look like? Like... There's the ones I want. The ones I told you about. How much do they retail for? They're expensive, aren't they? Mm-hmm. 850. <laughs> <laughs> retail. I'll give you a second chance. Retail, not resale. Retail. Is retail higher than resale? No, retail's lower. Right. How much did I buy my Jordan 14s for? Oh, 200. Okay, I'll give you that. Okay. The correct answer is 190, but other releases have been 200 and other releases have been 225. Sorry, I got confused so, between those two. It's okay. So, 8 for 14. We're right. getting there. We're getting back. So, question number 15. Name two people that have collabed with Adidas. Travis Scott. Right? No, no, no. Adi stop, stop. Adidas. 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 Okay, sorry. That's wrong person. Honey West. Okay, one more. Does it have to be, like, actual person, or can it be, like, Marvel? Like you said in the previous question. Yeah, that's like, fine. Okay, so Marvel and Kanye West. Okay. Even though I said two people, I'll count that because she ain't doing real good right now. <laughs> so name two people that have collabed with Nike. Question number 16. Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan. Okay, you just name one. Travis Scott. Okay, so she is 10 for 16 right now, pretty sure. Okay, here's a question. This is the one I think you will not get, but what is a PE? If you'd like, give me a decent description of it, then I'll give it to you. I guess that's has to do with shoes, right? Yes, a PE. I'll give you a hint. So NBA players, they get their own shoes that are, like, limited to only them and a few other people, so, like... The P stands for player, so what is P? -E? Player edition. Is that stupid? Is that wrong? Okay, I got this. Wait. It's okay. You're not very, even... That was very close. I, I'll, give, I'll give player edition to you. That's fine. It's, what does it it's mean? It's player exclusive. Okay, that that counts. That was close. That was okay. close. Number 18. Name three Vans collabs. Okay, previous said Marvel. Okay. Is that right? Disney? Yes. Okay. Marvel, Disney, one more. There's a, been a ton. So if I probably say one, it's probably right. Maybe. Nickelodeon. She was actually correct with Nickelodeon, so I apologize in advance. I'll give you another chance. Is that not no, right? No. Star Wars? Correct, okay. Okay. Question number 21. How many sneakers has Kyrie Irving produced? So, every player has their own amount of sneakers they produce. Is this like a good amount? Is this a lot? Or is this like... It's pretty decent, so... I have the Kyrie 3s, you know? The white and blue ones. So, think about like when I got those, and like think about like now. So, Kyrie 3. So, how many Kyries are there now? 25. <laughs> <laughs> what is it, 13? What did you just say? 25! <laughs> if I got a shoe three years ago, what's three plus three? Oh, six. 25. That is incorrect. What is wrong? <laughs> 25! If you, if you produce a sneaker a year, how do you get 25? I don't know. <laughs> So dumb. Number 22. Name one collab Crocs has done. You talked about these when they came out. I thought they were ugly. Did I? Yeah. Not so. Did I? No, I say so much, I don't know what to say. Okay, there's one that's a famous country star everybody obsesses over, and then there's one that's a famous pop star that everybody oh, obsesses over. Oh, um, Post Malone. Good job. Post Malone Crocs have been a collab, correct. Okay, so I have a pair of Jordan 1 Lowe's, so how much do Jordan 1 Lowe's retail for? Retail is not resale. Resale is more expensive. Retail is what the price is when they release. Jordan 1 Lowe's, very similar to an Air Force. 100. Okay, I'll give it to you. It's either 90 or 100. Usually 90, though, unless it's a special edition shoe, and then it'll be a 100. Who is Tinker Hatfield a designer for? So brands, like any brand. Tinker Hatfield? Tinker Hatfield. A designer for it? Is this shoe? It's a shoe guess. brand. Is this a popular shoe brand? Yes. Nike. Good job. Tinker Hatfields design shoes like the Air Jordan 3 that I have, the Air Max 1 that I have, and stuff like that. How much do Air Max 270s retail for? This is lower. Air Max 270s, the shoes you want. You don't know how much they retail for? 150. Okay, good job. What would be one of the least expensive sneaker brands? Is this a variety of answers? If you answer one of the two I have in my head, you'll get it right. So, one of the least expensive sneaker brands, so the le least costing shoes. Puma or Reebok, probably. No. That is incorrect. Great value. Did this man say great value? Lizzie, great value is Walmart's food brand. What are you talking about? That is incorrect. <laughs> the um, answer is Vans. 
and Converse. They retail for 50 to 60 bucks. So. Oh, you don't really think of those as like sneakers, though. I think of those as like slide-ons. Vans is a sneaker brand, not a slide-on van. So you are incorrect. Yeah. All right. So that was all our questions and name the th stuff. But now I'm gonna get into my photos, and we will be right back. All right. Sorry about that. I had to pick some more sneakers for this list. But I have six sneakers right here. This is basically Lizzie's. I'm going to show Lizzie the sneakers, and she's going to guess what the sneaker is. So I didn't choose anything extremely difficult, but I don't know how much sneaker knowledge she has. So let's just see what she's got. Not a lot. First shoe. Okay, I'll put it right there. Air Maxes. What number are they called? So they start off with 90. So there's an Air Max 90. They're not 270. Air Max 90, Air Max 1, Air Max 95, Air Max 97, Air Max 98. 97. Um, yes, that's correct. And these are the Sean Witherspoons. These are the most expensive Air Max 97s probably this. out there. They're like over a thousand. So. All right, next shoe. We got a what? Jordan. Okay. Jordan Retro. Jordan Retro. Okay. So. I'm not doing too bad. So right that's now. not really correct. I'm, I'm going to give it's you. It's not correct. It is correct, but you're going to have to give me the number of them. So one to ten. What do you think they are? So I have threes. They're not threes. I want fours. I have ones. Okay. Not one, four. What do you, you, don't, you don't have, They're not three. They're not, not four. Not one, three, or four. Just go with eight. I'll give you one more chance. Seven. No. Nine. Six. <gasps> For Aaron Jordan, six. So if she misses two more, she fails. So it's probably two. already failed, to tell you the truth. Let's see what He's she's cutting me slack. Got. Yeah, I'm trying to. All right, here's another Jordan. As you can tell, it looks Never pretty, seen before. pretty new. So what Very would you, new. Very new. What do they go up to? I have no idea. Like, so, I, don't, I don't know if they're 200 or 100. The true or false was, is there Jordans up to 35? And you got it wrong, so. 34s. Okay, these are the 34s. Is that your answer? Yes. That is correct. Yes! Good job. Say about okay. that, that. There are three more sneakers. These should be pretty easy for her, but let's see what she's got. What are these called? Vans. What is this model called? So, obviously, they're not the slip-ons. They're not the old schools. What are they? I don't know, but I don't like them. What are they called? Band tie-ups. Incorrect. These are the Vans Era or the Vans Authentic? Yeah, I would have never knew, guessed that. I mean, I've seen them before. I don't, I don't know that. You love Vans. So. I do love Vans. All right. I so we got two is. shoes left. And these are very familiar to Lizzie, so I do not think she's going to get these incorrect. What are those? Ultra Boost. <coughs> Bless me. So what year are these? 2019. 2018. What? They're not 4.0s. They're Lizzie, not 4.0s. What year are these? I'm wearing the 2019s now. What is your final answer? If it looks different than 2020s. Ultra Boost 2020, is that your final answer? Yes. That is correct. Yes! Okay, one it. more question. If you get this wrong, you are dumb because... Oh my gosh, I don't know these. <laughs> you own these. I so. know! Okay. New balances. Okay. Pink. Okay, what's the number? Can you tell me numbers? <laughs> Just give me a buzz. From 500 to 600. I recently sold these for Lizzie. or they're, they're selling right now on Poshmark, so... Let's so, go buy them if you want them. Yeah. I will give you within 25 of this. Okay, is it like 100 or is it like I said it was 500, 500 to 600. 570. That is incorrect. You've got your own Dang shoe it. wrong. <laughs> this is the New Balance 501 Ripple Sole. Sorry, y'all. I would have known that. And she's the one that bought them with her own money. Good job. But I'm going to go through the score and I think she got 20 out of 30, but we're just going to check. So, we'll be right back. Okay, we got the final results. I kind of miscounted a few times, but Lizzie is not very happy right now because I said if you get 20 out of 30, then you, you pass. Cream. No, I never said that. 20 out of 30 means that you pass, but 19 out of 30 means that you fail. So Lizzie got 19 out of 30. We're going to put into my Siri, what is 19 divided by 30? Hey Siri, what is 19 divided by 30? 19 divided okay. by 30. So, I did really good. So 63%. So, yes! So that is technically passing. So Lizzie was about one away from not passing. So Lizzie, you got a 63 out of 100. Thank you. Not bad. Thank um, you. I definitely could have got like a 100 out of 100. Not that you look as serious no every day or anything. You're but... not wrong. And I don't. So. But if you made it to the end of the video, we comment love you. down below. Lizzie with a Y. Lizzie with a Y loves Beyonce. Yeah! So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As Leslie said earlier, let's get it to 20 likes. So, stop copying me, Anna. Okay. Hope you guys have an amazing day. And as always, peace out! Beep.